Paul. Um, yeah, so I'll just get started on everything I got. I got most of it at Target, and then some of it is just stuff that um, my mom bought a little while ago and didn't like, so she gave to me. So yeah, just get started. Um, the first thing I got is the CoverGirl True Blends Mineral Bronzer in Mineral Bronzer Bronzer in Natural Bronze. I think, yeah, in Natural Bronze. It looks like this. Um, I like it, but it's a little dark for me, and also it's wicked, wicked, wicked shimmery. Like it's scary how shimmery it is. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, and it's going to go everywhere if I, like, I don't know if you can see all the sparkles, but it's, like, really shimmery. I don't know if you can see that. That's it right there. It's wicked dark, and it's really shimmery for me. Like, I don't like wicked shimmery stuff on my face, and that's just really shimmery, so I, like, I put it on my legs over the tan I already have. I know that's really odd. But it like makes it shimmery and it's kind of pretty when you're laying in the sun. So yeah. Next, I got the Maybelline Mineral Power Blush in the color Soft Mauve. Mauve, 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 mauve. Um, don't ask me. I don't speak that language. Looks like this, and um, I don't know if you can read that. Soft mauve. Mauve, M A U V E. And is it gonna focus? I'm like shaking, so it's not working. But, um, yeah, I like this. It's a little dark for me, also, but if you blend it out really well, it works great. Um, I got this L'Oreal Quad in Landscape Passage, Passage, Passage. Pay, pay sage, pay sage. It's P A Y S H G E. Not really know what. You know, I don't speak that language either. Okay, <laughs> sorry. Um, looks like this. They're really pretty colors. I'm not a big fan of the green, but other than that, it's like a bronzy color, a highlight color, and like a dark brown color. Then there's like this sage green, this sage green. I'm really not a fan of it, but I mean, maybe I'll start to like it in the fall. They're really folly colors. I'm starting to get fall makeup, and it's really sad because I'm not ready for fall. I love summer. School starts in two and a half weeks, I think. It's really sad. Anyway, next, I've heard a lot about this, so I got this. Um, the L'Oreal Paris Studio Secrets Professional Magic Perfecting Base. Just looks like this. I've heard a lot about this from YouTube, so just looks like this. It's not white, even though it looks white on the camera. Hang on. Can you see that? It's like a really light, light pink color. Looks like that. So far, I like it. I haven't really used it. I've used it like twice, so I'm not really sure how big of a fan I am of it, but I've heard a lot of good things about it, so I'm hoping I like it. Next, I got a CoverGirl Cheekers Blush in Soft SBL. Really sure what that means, but okay. Um, looks like that. It's upside down. It just looks like that. It's also a little dark. I like getting things that are too dark for me, apparently. And this is really shimmery, but it's really pretty. I might actually use it as an eyeshadow. I don't know if you can see that. Really? This camera doesn't pick up colors at all. But yeah. I like that a lot. Next, I got a Wet n Wild um, bronzer in the color Princess. Looks like this. I don't really love Wet n Wild. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. But um, this is okay. It's, again, a little dark for me, but, you know, I think everything is a little dark for me. It looks like that uh, has a pretty design in it. But yeah, it's okay. I've only used it once, so I don't really. I used it once for. I don't know, I put it on randomly for no reason, and then I went to bed, so I don't really know if I like it. Anyway, um, next I got an All May Intense Eye Color Powder Shadow 
in the trio for hazels. My eyes aren't hazel, they're green, but I liked the color, so I got it anyway. I don't really go by what the color of my eyes are. I think that's just obnoxious. But, um, it looks like this. It's got, like, a pink, a brown, and a, like, creamy color. Looks like that. Um, they're really similar to the colors of Walking on Eggshells from Wet n Wild, and I love Walking on Eggshells, so I love this. Again, I've only used this stuff a couple of times, so I don't really know. Um, then I got a Mary Kay lipstick in the color Sunny Coral. It's a gorgeous color. Like, beyond gorgeous color. Um, looks like that. Um, it was used when I got it. Um, long story on how I got this. Such... Sorry, hang on. It's really close up. Oh yeah, I dyed my bangs. They're red. Yeah, anyway. But yeah, um, maybe I'll talk about how I got this later, but not here. Not now. Unbox me if you want to know. Let's keep it that way. Um, then I got a Clinique lipstick in the color A Different Grape. It's really dark, but it's really sheer. And, um, if you put, like, a clear gloss over it, it's really pretty. It's just really dark for my skin tone, but when I'm tan, it works. So, yeah. Sorry, I've got quite a few things in here. Um, then I got another Elme Intense Powder Eye Color Powder Shadow, and this is the trio for greens. So my eyes are green. La 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 la. Um, I don't really like these colors. This is why I have in green eyes because they have like the worst colors. But it looks like this. It's like a bronzy brown, then like a green brown, and then like a like yellow. <laughs> not pretty at all, but whatever. I, they're pretty if you, like, put them together and make a cute, like, look out of them, but other than that, eh, eh. sorry, I don't like her. Anyway, um, then I got, got a, can you stay, please? Another Clinique, uh, lipstick in thick bronze. It looks like this. It's really pretty. I love this color. I'm actually going to swatch it just to show you guys. But it comes out really sheer. Anyway, it looks like that. This is it right here. So yeah, I like that a lot. If you guys want me to do a tutorial or anything I have in here, just let me know. Um, I'm only 14 and a half, whatever. But, um, I got the Ole Regenerist Anti Aging Eye Roller. Um,. <laughs> I'm really scared that when I get old, I'm going to be, like, wrinkly and gross, and I'm going to have, like, these really bad bags under my eyes. And I really don't want that. So I got this. It just looks like that, and you, like, pump it, and stuff comes out, and you put it under your eyes. And I put mine on my eyes, too. I don't really know what it's going to do to me, but I do it anyway. And, um, it's just, like, all it says is avoid contact with eyes. Well, no kidding. I'm not stupid. Anyway, well, it's just, like, to help you not have wrinkles and bags and whatever. So I got it. I know I'm a little young for it, but I got it anyway. Whatever. I'm not even... I'm probably not even going to use it, and if I do, it's because I'm scared. But anyway. And then this stuff is the stuff that I just got, like, today or yesterday. One of those two days. I went to Target and got the rest of the stuff I'm going to show you. So... In one of my favorites videos, I showed you my e.l.f. golden bronzer, like, palette thing, and I've already hit pan on it, and I like mixing them together, but you can't really mix them together when the middle's gone, so I, I'm going to use the rest of that, but I bought a new one, it's the e.l.f. golden bronzer, create a healthy looking glow with the shimmering bronze, the sheer soft powders prove provide an uh, illuminating shimmer and these colors are ideal for summer or year round. Blend all four colors together to create a shimmering glow. Dust on cheek cheekbones, cheeks, and slightly around the edges of face for a healthy glow look. So I love this. It's there's another one in here, so I'll keep that for when I'm out. And um elf at my target or my local target goes really quickly. So when they have elf I get it. Like, they just got the new stuff for, like, college or whatever, which is, like, the palettes and everything, so I am 
trying to get all of them before. I don't know what just happened. Hello? Ooh, sorry, okay. My computer just went, like, to sleep. I don't know if it just cut off or not. But anyway, the next thing I got was the Maybelline Define Line Eyeliner. Because I had one, and it was in one of my favorites videos, I think. Or I showed it in something. And I misplaced it. Well, I didn't misplace it. One of my... We went on a trip with, like, the place that I go for somewhere. And, um... One of my friends was there, and I was redoing my eyeliner, and they took it and snapped it and threw it at a car. And then the car ran over it, because there was someone in the car when they threw it, and they weren't really happy. So, I didn't have it anymore. It was broken. So, I bought a new one, because I've been missing the heck out of it, because I've been using... I don't know what I've been using. I don't even know, because um, it's not even mine. It was a friend's that they took for me. So, anyway, I didn't just say that. So... I've been missing this, so I finally got another one, and I'm really happy about it. I don't even have it opened yet. <laughs> Next, I've been dying for this product. I've heard so much about it that I've just been like, I need to get it, I need to get it, I need to get it. But every time I went to the store, I never got it. So yesterday, I did. It's the Maybelline New York um, Mascara, the Falsies Volume Express Mascara in Black Drama. It just looks like... That it's like curved a little bit. I love it. I have it on my eyelashes now. I'm absolutely obsessed with it, and I just got it yesterday. I remember it's yesterday that I got it. So yeah, I'm really happy. Really, really, really happy about this. I'm gonna like stock up because if they ever get rid of this, I'm gonna cry. Anyway, next I got the Revlon Quad in Not Just Nudes, the cream shadows. I love this. Um, looks like that. I've made quite a bit of a dent into them because I actually have it on right now and I had it on yesterday. Um, really gorgeous colors. I love them. Okay, it looks really dirty on the camera, but it's not. It's like still perfect. It's really weird. And then it comes with that little mirror right there. I don't want to like blind you, but anyway. And then my last thing is probably my favorite thing that I got. Um. I'm really happy about this. I've been wanting it for a while, but they only had it online. They never had it at the store. And I don't know. It was. It's one of the most expensive things they have. Well, not the most expensive thing because they have stuff for like $30 or whatever. But um, I got the e.l.f. Eyes, Lips, Face 100 color eyeshadow palette. And I just got this yesterday. And I've been doing swatches and stuff all day and whatever. And um, I like it more than the Coastal Scents palette. Like, I don't, I never thought that'd be possible, because I, like, baby that thing, even though it got stepped on and it's broken, but whatever. Um, I love this. It's, like, perfect. Like, if I ever go on a trip or anything, this is all I need. Well, then, eyeliner and mascara, whatever, but for eyeshadows, it's all I need, because it legit has every color I think I've ever used, or I'll ever use. It goes from, like, blacks and silvers to browns to like orangey browns to orange to pink to red like this is a gorgeous red like I've never seen a red and then look at how gorgeous red that is I'm like obsessed with it and then pinks and purples and blues and aquas and greens and yellows and then more browns and then like pinky brown brown and then like cream colors and highlight colors like it's so gorgeous so yeah, I think I'm going to do like a video with this and take like a bunch of swatches and stuff so you can see the colors. This is $10 at either Target or online. It's it's worth it. I mean, it's really not that bad because you're getting 100 and for what, $20 you're getting 88 colors. And I honestly, honestly am telling you my honest opinion right now, I like that better than Coastal Scents, which is really hard for me to say. So yeah, that's it for my haul. Um, I hope you enjoyed, and please subscribe. Bye!